Hello, YouTubers. This is Anubifier. It's Thursday, and that means inside Star Citizen on Logos, CIG has been busy releasing an update for basically all of 2021, which I have linked up for you right now. And here's what you need to know about today's show in one minute and nine seconds. Branding is the glue that holds the immersion together. The branding tends to follow the stature of the environment. Logos need to be built as if they were for a real company, and the process obviously takes time and creativity. The team gets a full concept brief on the product and then they set to work. They demoed a new asset called the Voyager Bar, which seems to be kind of like a cookie cutter food bar that you might see at an airport. The concepts are brainstormed and then are ultimately checked to ensure that they aren't similar to an actual brand IRL. That's it for logos. Jared introduced the sprint report. Progress is being made on ship docking arms, which are in the gray box phase with a real effort put to many points of view and windows. These are being built to ensure that the metrics will work for all future ships. They're working on a space whale statue for Orison. They're working on new transition screens for when you die and respawn. The interior lighting team is working on three interior lighting states for the Hercules. The Redeemer is making its way through white box with updated metrics, but they're making sure to keep the iconic familiar shape. The Tonk is supposed to release soon and we got some updated feature shots. And then Jared ended with some pictures of random technical assets to fill out points of interest. That's it. A cool update. Thank you very much for spending your time with me. Fly safe and I'll see you in the verse.